The Ministry of Social Development and Family Services stands ready to provide the necessary relief assistance to all the families affected by the fire. So said Minister of Social Development and Family Services, Senator the Honorable Donna Cox, during a visit she made on Sunday, January 2, 2022, following the fire which took place at Quarry Road, Port of Spain. Four homes were gutted by a fire which occurred on January 1 along Quarry Street in Port of Spain, affecting seven families, comprising of 23 persons in total. During a meeting today at the St. Hilda's Government Primary School, the Minister Donna Cox, accompanied by Permanent Secretary Jacqueline Johnson and other ministry staff, told the affected residents that the ministry is present today on a data collection drive so that assessments can be completed as early as possible to help bring some relief to affected persons. Also present was... On the state. Yes. So we have asked them to look for somewhere yeah, so that we can assist them with the rent, to pay for the rental yes. in the first instance. There's also a clothing grant and there's also a grant for books for children, oh, which um, we would be willing to assist. We have also offered counselling because, of course, this is indeed a traumatic situation and um, we feel that counselling must be involved. So the ministry will also provide counselling. Also present was an officer attached to the City Corporation Disaster Relief Department for a combined approach to providing assistance. Minister Cox told residents that upon receiving information, the ministry dispatched several of its officers attached to the National Family Services Division as well as the National Social Development Program to journey with the affected families so that the relevant funding as well as counseling and psychosocial support could be offered in the shortest possible time. As she examined some of the damage herself, the minister offered words of comfort to the affected families and encouraged them that things will get better. Minister Cox indicated that she held discussions with the Member of Parliament for the area, the Honourable Stuart Young, and further noted that the ministry will continue to partner with other agencies like the National Commission for Self-Help Limited, the Elections and Boundaries Commission.